uh, to this, uh, this question of utmost important, importance. When asked by a student, why should I care? Who cares? Why? I think it is essential for anyone, be it Mr. Adams and myself, when, when we speak to students, or anyone who is taking on that burden of teaching, to avoid the temptation to try to tell them why they are supposed to care. As soon as we start doing that, you have to do this, or why they are supposed to respect me, or why they are supposed to respect George Washington, or, or, or respect anything, then I think we fall into a trap, because students, any person with a free mind, which means any person with, an, with a mind that is not so damaged as to not be able to think, any person will, will recoil at that, be they sixth graders, or someone who's come to their majority. We should start by finding out what they care about, and speaking to that, like Dr. Staten had mentioned earlier, as one example. To that end, then, I would say that one of the uses of studying history acknowledges that they may study, for instance, me, and condemn aspects of my life, decisions I made or failed to make, and let them know that I encourage them in that activity of judging even me, especially me. But here's why. This is not me with some kind of a mea culpa or condemning myself. They have a responsibility to judge, to exercise, to, to judge. And if you're going to judge, you must understand. If you're going to understand those you're going to judge, you must learn about them. You must judge those who have come before you. Because one day, you, the living generation, will be judged by those who come after you. And they're not going to praise you for the accomplishments of the generations that came before you. So, for instance, if your students are born in an America where slavery is illegal, they're never going to be praised for not owning slaves. I was born a slave owner, but for your students to own slaves, they'd have to break the law. So if they learn to understand, and I'm not excusing myself here, but my point is, the more they understand the specifics of those historical situations that they will come to condemn by justifiably exercising their educated judgment, they will train themselves to look for those challenges in their lifetime. Dare I say, their slavery. Slavery was the challenge that defeated my generation. We overcame some challenges. What are the cha they, will, this, they will train themselves to look for those templates in their lifetime. That they will be judged 200 years from their lifetime as to whether or not they succeeded in overcoming them, as we did with introducing democracy to America, or if they failed in overcoming them, as we failed, with, we, we, we failed to end slavery.